Hi Brittany, I thought I'd just show you a, a quick example on uh, to do some of these layouts that we can see here that you've previously had done. So we're looking at a, uh, um, a theatre style plan um, set to a certain angles. So what I'm going to do, just give you an idea on how I'm going to do it. So I'm just going to drag out this chair and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to hit the copy button and I'm going to create a row. Um, we might create a few rows. So Let's grab that, hit copy right. Now, what I might do is I might just copy this down and maybe one, two, three. So let's take out a chair in this row, two chairs in that row, three chairs in that row, four chairs in that row. So what I can do now is I can do two options. I could either just grab this area and move it to the right. I can grab this and I can hit copyright and there's a button here for flip horizontal and I'm just doing that there. So there's uh, the seating configuration. Now what you can do is that you can then change the angle and set that in place. So maybe we're going to have one there, obviously this is very wide and what I might do is there's an option here um, which allows us to group objects together. Now the shortcut is just up here or you hold down shift control G to group it. Now what it does is that's just going to group all these as one item. So now let's move it across the other side of the room and I'm going to flip it horizontal and there we are there. What I might do now is move it down the bottom and I'm going to use the button here, flip vertical. So there we can see that we're starting to do um, the layout. So now that I've got all those there, I'm just going to ungroup it, shift control U, and that's how easy it is to do.